Your friends in need will love you. I'm about to switch from a road to a forest. There is something very important you gotta do. Look, you don't have to be a bicycle expert to know that when you're switching from normal road to a forest, if you lower your PSI or your pressure in your tire, you have better traction. On trails like this, it makes a huge difference. But how do you do it? Some people carry those cartridges that you use the CO2 cartridges, and I always hated them. They're one-time use, half of them spill out, and then all of a sudden you're left in the middle of nowhere with no pressure in your tires. I needed something small, it can fit in one of these compartments, and I didn't want a manual pump, so I got this. The beauty of this thing is that First of all, I found on Amazon, they're about 20 bucks. I'm going to put a link at the bottom of the video. But also, it works on motorcycles and bicycles. And for those people who are going to ask, how many times can you inflate a tire with it? Well, on a bicycle, I have 10 times and the battery didn't even move. Here it is. This is a rechargeable pump that you could inflate your tires with. It has a couple of buttons on it. This is a power button. It turns on. It's a backlit display. Shows you either in PSI or in... Uh, bar, KPA, or kilogram per centimeters. So which one are you used to? I'm used to PSI from United States. Uh, you set the pressure, desired pressure. In my case, I'm gonna run 33, let's say 33. So 72, I think is the highest that it goes. 72.5. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna have a big problem because I took all the air out of the tire. I'm gonna set it up to 33. I'm going to plug it in, push the power button. There it is. My tire is inflated and I'm good to go. And I still have full battery. Found this thing on Amazon. They go for about $20. They cost as much as those stupid CO2 cartridges. A little bit bigger but they're so much more versatile and unless you want to carry a hand pump and do it by hand which is going to take a while this is a lifesaver i'm going to put a link at the bottom of the video let me know what you think this is a awesome cool tool to have for your bike especially in the woods thanks for watching